wild night last night, didn't we, Allie? <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you tell the fans what happened last night? <laughs> well, technically it was at 4 in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> Correct. <laughs> okay, cut. Good morning, fans. <laughs> don't say fans. <laughs> Had a wild day last night. We did have a wild night last night, didn't we? Okay. Is that what you're supposed to look at? Yeah. We had a wild night last night. Morning. <laughs> <laughs> we're on our way to Santa Barbara. We were in Pelican Harbor on uh, Santa Cruz Island. And four in the morning, we're both sleeping <laughs> snug in a bug. Like a bug in a rug. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Cozy. And the and boat. The boat started pitching. It did. Like a bucking bronco. Mm hmm. Like a wild bronco from the west. <laughs> and we got up. Um, as I got up to check on the boat, the anchor alarm went off. Uh, saying that we are outside of our proximity we are dragon anchor basically towards a cliff yeah with the cliff 50 feet behind us or something 100 feet you could hear the waves smashing on the rocks and it was time to go <laughs> it was time to go, it was time to go. <laughs> so sorry, lickety split this. quick as a nip we put on our clothes jumped out started the engine headlamps stopped working headlamps not working you didn't have knives on i don't us? we don't have knives on us i'm practically naked <laughs> and uh we pulled the anchor up and got the <laughs> out of there oh we did aaron smashed his finger I smashed my finger, but uh, it's all okay. Lessons learned. Be prepared. Don't be dumb. Allie's a hero. We could. Oh, I'm a hero. Yeah. Because <laughs> I kept us calm. Because she kept us calm. I was panicking, running around, naked. <laughs> oh no! Oh. Moral of the story is be more prepared, which we typically try to be um we failed last night but not completely because we got out of there okay with only a smashed finger not too bad just a bruised ego and a smashed finger
wonderful cinematographer. Laundry time. Shower time. Really, really dirty. I'm like Santa Claus on the dock. Oops. Dirty bag of laundry for all the kids. <laughs> Merry Christmas. I like traveling, but that's definitely one of the painful parts of traveling. It's doing your laundry in different places every time. And you never know what you're going to get. You pick like this. Like, that's disgusting. Pick that. Oh yeah. oh yeah, we're headed south. Coming from Washington. Coming from Washington yeah. State. Uh, Port Townsend. Yeah. 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 Nice. All right. Yeah, that's yeah, a beautiful <laughs> spot. We just picked up fuel in Santa Barbara and we bought 17 gallons. That means that's all we used in a month of cruising coming a from over a, month. a little over a month. The last place we filled up was Half Moon Bay. So that's a long time. Yeah. That's pretty good, I think. Fuel's so expensive. It's a hundred it's uh six fifty a gallon, so we spent $110. So we try not to use too much. We're a sailboat, so. We're not a motorboat at this time. Slow moving sailboat. <laughs> we get stuck in these cozy anchorages and we have to make love. <laughs> make love. <laughs> We should not use that. She's a pervert. Should not use Filming each other. That's great. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,
We left Santa Barbara a couple hours ago thinking that we're going to overnight sail um, to Catalina. There is a big gale offshore that we would like, we are trying to avoid. here on Santa Cruz Island. We sailed across the Santa Barbara Channel. We're on our way to Catalina Island, but we have to decide what we're gonna do. So we're stopping here in this anchorage. We're gonna eat some dinner and look at the weather, look at the chart, try and figure out if we should go through the night to Catalina, try to catch some wind, and then motor the rest of the way, or if we should stay the night and go in the morning. Four forty in the morning. We just pulled up the anchor. We're headed to Catalina Island. Looks like it's gonna be a long motor today. Um, a little sleepy, huh? Allie's in bed. We let her rest. So it's all of us. One of us is rested. There was a gale last night. Uh, we decided to hang out in Smuggler's Cove on Santa Cruz Island. Uh, it was well protected, and uh, we were have dinner and get some sleep and. Um, it was nice to relax a bit. Considered going overnight, we got beat up a bit coming across the strait, and uh, dinner sounded pretty appealing. It's 75 miles to Catalina, I think. Um, if we go full speed, we'll be there in 10 hours. Uh, 2.30, I think, yeah, 2.30. Here we go. Four and a half miles away. This is the part where I always get impatient. Can't wait to stop motoring. I'm hungry. I'm tired of steering. Just cruising through the bay. My sweet love alley. Pulling into Catalina Harbor here. We're gonna gamble at the casino. Wow. Splash around to the pool. We do not get to go gambling. That is for rich, stupid people. Wow. <laughs> it's a bad idea. She doesn't want to be rich. I'm stingy. I'll show her though. We just anchored in Catalina Harbor. It's full of mooring balls deep in the harbor back here. And then a couple of like junk rafts back here. And it's very deep. Um, we're at 52 feet right now. 
Uh, we dropped in like 70 feet of water back there. So we have about 200 feet of road out. So we're not expecting it to blow up. It should be fine. But uh, we're very close to this thing. I hope we don't smash into it in the night. complex language. They're very intelligent. All right, that was a steep ass hike. Look who I found. My favorite person in the world. Hey. I wish I could fly. Trying to remove the prickly part of the pear. Don't get stabbed too much. Allie, I got a prickly pear. Wow. <laughs> nice. Here we are on beautiful Catalina Island. <laughs> Going for a hike. <laughs> Let's go. All right. We're exploring. <laughs> the dusty leaves. <laughs> what do we have here? Dusty fronds. Oh, dusty. Oh, yeah. So dusty. What's this? Dusty hardware. Ha ha ha.